Welcome to Arizona Gardening with Rob and Sherry. Hi guys, this is Rob from Arizona and uh, this is my gardening channel and I'm just doing another update and so it's the end of March. It's like March 27th and I thought I'd kind of give you an update of how the garden's going. <coughs> so you can see it's uh, going well. <laughs> and, uh, so the z uh, zucchini is doing really well. Uh, it's starting to produce some z zucchini which is cool. Uh, next to that is peppers. Those are fairly new and those uh, should go into the summer very well. Strawberries are coming along fine but I don't expect a lot of uh, production until next year. Uh, these of course are my purple onions and carrots. Carrots are doing very well. So it won't be uh, too long here. We'll be pulling some carrots. So we told you last time the radishes were doing great. So we harvested all the radishes and did a second planting. So down here you can see all of our new little radishes all coming in. So uh, we're excited about that. The, uh, the radishes are a nice little treat. Spinach, of course, is going nuts again. This is all of our spinach. And uh, it's getting to a point now where we're harvesting every, at least once a week. And uh, we are actually starting to cook or blanch our spinach and freezing it. Because we just can't eat that much. So uh, next to that is regular uh, yellow, to, uh, yellow onions. And they're coming along very well. And uh, this year I kind of planted them probably too deep, but uh, we're kind of opening up the ground to let them enlarge. But uh, live and learn. <laughs> Our green onions are all coming along really well right in here. And those aren't too far away from uh, <laughs> plucking. And uh, our uh, Walla Walla onions are starting out fine. Uh, it's going to be a while before they can become good size. But that's these right here. Or all that. Next to that is more peppers. These little guys in here. And we had to uh, thin out the lettuce. There's just too much lettuce for us to handle. So uh, I cut some back, uh, I may have cut them too low, I don't know if they're going to come back, but I still have plenty of lettuce to uh, support me and Sherry. So uh, they're coming along pretty good. So this is all of our lettuce. And I actually uh, got a mixed blend lettuce that I put in here, and uh, it's actually thriving. And of course uh, our beans are... Uh, beans are starting or peas are starting to produce and the bean plants are taking off just great but uh, I think it'll be a little while before they produce anything then over here the tomatoes is my little happy place so I have large I have, I have cherry tomatoes medium potato um, tomatoes and large ones so my little cherry tomatoes have a little surprise for me look here get the camera to hold still and yeah, we're starting to produce cherry tomatoes and I'll be pulling that soon and then this is the strangest tomato plant it's kind of growing to the side instead of up really beefy plant but uh, if we look really close here we have a little surprise look at that that is one fine looking little tomato come out of there so We'll be pulling those pretty soon. I wanted to record this before we pull the tomatoes. Last but not least is the Walla Walla onions over here. They're all coming along pretty good. You know, we just got them started about two weeks ago and they're doing well. They're thriving. Uh, just got to let them grow and enlarge. And then we have one pot here that's empty. It looks empty, but it's actually. Uh, garlic so we got right here and uh, so we'll be excited to see the garlic starting to show up so we'll share that with you so the garden 
is is coming along pretty good the next goal we have is from the house up here we're going to put in a shade system because in Arizona we're going to start getting hotter temperatures and we want to protect the plants a little bit from too much heat so uh, yeah that's our update uh, watering systems been working well I, I did lose a uh, strawberry plant because of, it failed to work when I was on vacation so two out of the three <laughs> strawberry plants well one out of the three this one survived just great this one I was trying to recover but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it and then this one fully recovered it was almost gone so it was kind of sad but I'll know better next time so anyway that's my report for this week it's the end of March, and uh, I'll do an update in another week or so. Anyway, talk to you later, guys. Bye. Hey, thanks for watching Outdoor Travel Channel and Gardening with Rob. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. We really appreciate that. Talk to you next time. Bye.